Hari Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Today we are going to discuss one of the fundamental procedures to follow during puja or during worship So for our right hand we use our right hand for all the procedures to be done for the puja In that right hand thumb is the angushta tarjani madhyama anamika kanishtika So these are the names of these five fingers out of which this finger tarjani or the index finger has its own significance what are some of the applications of this finger during our day to day normal life we use this finger to threaten people we use this finger to point out the mistakes in others we use this finger also to point out the greatness self indulgence self appraisal oh i have done this i am so great i have been there also i have done this also also we use this finger to point out the things that we own or we think we own oh this is mine that is also mine oh these are mine so to round up this finger represents ego arrogance and self indulgence which should not be anywhere near when we are doing puja when we are worshiping so when we are doing a puja we are sitting in front of the lord and we are saying without any of ego or self indulgence anger or any of those rajo guna attributes or any of those virtues i offer my sincere prayers to you and i offer my gratitude to you so it is important not to include this finger during the puja procedures so some of the puja procedures where we normally tend to use this finger is during the picking up of flowers and offering it or when we take akshata as an offer to the lord or any other procedure where we have to use the fingers for that remember use the thumb middle finger and the ring finger so if you have to pick a flower pick the flower with these three fingers and offer it to the lord if you have to pick some akshatas use these three fingers and offer it to the lord so the main application when we are applying the tilak or vibhuti use the ring finger and apply your tilak or buttu or vibhuti whatever you call and also the other important thing is when we are applying the tripundras it is very common to see people applying it with these three fingers from left to right so the actual procedure is to again not include the index finger in this procedure first take the middle finger and the ring finger and spread them put the vibhuti on top of these fingers and from left to right so you are going to apply the top most horizontal line and the bottom most horizontal line first from left to right you are going to apply those two lines from end to end and once that is done you are going to take the thumb use the vibhuti and from right to left you are going to apply the middle horizontal line so that is the actual procedure to be followed while putting the vibhuti bhasma or tripundras also it is important to chant bhagwan's name while applying tilak or vibhuti or tripundras for best results so that is our discussion topic for today sarvam shri krishna arpanamastu shri gurubhyo namaha